Hello everyone, it's Jen here, the Diamond Painting Gamer. Very warm welcome to my channel and um, a very warm welcome to um, a stash video. So last year I did um, my Cheap and Cheerful stash drawer and I've showed you all the paintings that I had in there. Uh, what I will do is I will link that video down below. I have added to that drawer since. So um, I might do another video of the Cheap and Cheerful stash, stash drawer later on in the year. But um, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to start to go through and show you my other stash. My other paintings in my stash. Okay, primarily sort of premium kits. So I'm going to have to break this down into several videos, um, basically because I've got so many. I haven't counted them. I don't intend to count them. <clears throat> I'm frightened to count them. Um, Diamond Art Club will be broken into two, possibly three videos. Um, that will be coming further down the line. But today, what we are going to look at is we are going to look at Paint Gem, Craft Buddy, Crafties and Spell Queen. Yep. I think those are all the ones that I've got looked out for this video. <clears throat> um, next video, um, I'm intending on doing Dreamer Designs, Diamond Art Studio, Treasure Studios, Art and Uniquely Years Down Under. So another four different companies. Now, some of these I have unboxed, some of them I haven't unboxed. If I haven't unboxed it, it will still be staying in its side. It's cellophane wrap. Um, I think it depends. We'll see um, because it'd be nice to do a proper unboxing to do the give the paintings, you know, their justice, you know, their time to shine rather than as part of a stash video. Anyway, we'll start off with Paint Gem. Um, this one I have unboxed and it is the Space Edition. Um, I am currently working on um, the Space Edition Volume 2 or um, Edition 2. Um, it in um I've got it in at my work and I'm working through it at work so you know that is you know a project that is ongoing a, a work in progress but I haven't started this one so that's the space edition I did unbox it we have got some absolutely gorgeous um images here um of different um sort of like uh, astro bodies if you like in space all with a black or dark blue background I think that Kay over at Crafting with Kay has got this and she's making this, uh, she's been done a few of these already and they look absolutely stunning. So um, yeah, check her out if you want to see um, a couple of these because I know uh, I have seen videos of her doing them. So yes, so uh, Space Edition. I do like my Craft Buddy, uh, not my Craft Buddy, sorry, my <laughs> Paint Gem. Um, yeah, I love these wee mini kits. Now, once I haven't unboxed, I will do a proper unboxing of them. But I have got the cats edition. Meow, meow, meow. Of course, I had to have little kitty cats. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen different cat breeds in here. And my little Kenny's there, Bengal. Um, they don't have a calico cat, unfortunately. Um which is my other cat, Pepper. But yeah, so we have got our cats. I think because she's a mogi and not a breed. So, you know, particular cat breed. And we also have the mystery edition. Now, um, I have heard, I'm, I'm not going to look at the back because that will give away what the paintings are, but I have heard that these mystery um, paintings aren't uh, brand new. Um, paintings they have been released in other kits and I did have a quick scooch at the back before and a couple of those kits I actually have had so I'm going to have duplicates but it'll be fun to do them as a mystery rather than as you know a painting that I know so you know I've, I've got that so anyway those are my three paint gems we have um, space cats and mystery right Okay, I'm going to pause in between each um, 
company just to give me time to sort of move things around so now we are going to move on to craft buddy so we're now on to craft buddy uh, i have unboxed all of these craft buddy kits uh, we'll start off with an off the canvas item it is my only off the canvas item that i haven't made up i was going to do it for christmas last year but um i didn't give myself enough time um i will probably do it no not probably i will do it this year um at some point during the year so that it's ready for this christmas <clears throat> but it is the christmas tree um these will um these companies will all have their own individual playlists by the way <coughs> so if you want to go and see the unboxings if you want to see the paint gem unboxings that i've done if you want to see the craft buddy unboxings that i've done um if you just go and look in my playlists um and you'll you know look for the company um you, you will find the ones that i have unboxed right next it's another christmas one this is a big one a bigger one so this is um the 40 by 50 light up one of the fireplace um craft buddy canvases uh, all come already mounted so they're really cool you don't need to worry about finding frames for them they're ready to hang as soon as you finish them so we have our fireplace i really like this actually i like the lights coming through it comes through on the the fireplace it comes through on the uh, candles as well and I've got my pepper cat in this one, <laughs> the little calico cat there. There's a Labrador on the floor. And I think there's another cat over here, if I remember right, too. So we have our um, cats, our, what's it called? Pets by the fireplace. And the last craft buddy kit that I have, still on the animal theme, is this... Um, moon gazing hair uh, i think this is I might, I might do this quite soon actually i really really like this painting um this is a 30 by 30. <clears throat> it says partial crystal um it's not a partial it's actually a full drill what they'll mean here partial crystal i think is that there's a mixture of crystals uh or special shapes and um regular drills regular uh, resin drills craft buddy use resin drills as do paint gem that you saw before in fact i think all of these companies that i'm showing you use resin drills so yes that are my those are my three craft buddies we have got the moon gazing here we have got our buildable tree and down on the floor there because it's quite big we have um our pets by the fireplace light up canvas okay two companies down two more to go right these ones will take a little bit longer because they are rolled up so um, i think we'll go with spell queen next because there's only two of them okay so a couple of spell queens now um i did think about putting all of the non-diamond art club canvases into one video and then i thought to myself it's going to go on for quite a long time and it involves a lot of pulling paintings out and putting them away and i didn't fancy doing all that at the one time so um that's the reason why we're kind of breaking them down a little bit anyway let's go on to spell queen and um, you'll see they're in two different kinds of bags um cam spell queen canvases i think now come in these sort of canvas bags um this is my most recent one that i bought um and this one was the first spell queen or one of the first spell queens i've bought because I've, I've done a couple of them um but it's an older canvas uh, they are poured glue and uh yeah let's take a look so let's look at this little this one first this one's smaller again i actually don't think i've unboxed any of these properly um, I think when I come to do them, I might do it as a combination unboxing and kitting up. Um, if I have unboxed these on my channel, I will, as I said, I will link, uh, they will be in a playlist that you can find. If not, um, I haven't unboxed them. <laughs> so, 
So this one is a nice little one. I have seen this made up. I think it might have been Whitney. Whitney Diamond Paints has made this up, but I think she got a bigger size than me. And it's the Sunflower. Now, how did I get this scent? Because you do get choices. At, I got a 30 by 40 round. That's super colourful. Oh, I want to do this one now. Yeah, this is this is the trouble. <laughs> this is the trouble with doing these videos, stash videos. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna open things up and I'm gonna find things and I'm gonna go like, oh my gosh, I want to do that. I want to kit this up. This is what I want to kit up and do. Nice drill, see. Eh? Anyway, I have my sunflower. And the other one is a bit bigger. And let's move the sunflower out of the way for a sec. Again, beautiful drills. Lots of purples and blues. And this one is a lovely lady. Let me roll it back a bit so, so I can get it into shot a bit better. I think, oh, this one's a square. This one's a square and it is 45 by 60. So she's lovely. There's only 23 colours in this, actually. So that quite a little bit of colour blocking going on in there. Her face, for example, is pretty much all one colour. But yes, there we go. We have a nice thumbnail up here. You can maybe see the detail a little bit better. So yes, we have this lovely lady and her flower. Uh, yeah, 40 by 50. No, not 40 by 50, 40 by 60. That's interesting. Hold on. The thumbnail says 40 by 60. Uh, the drill pack says 45 by 60. Hold on. I'm just going to give it a quick measure. This is, I said this wasn't going to turn into an unboxing. It's not going to be an unboxing because, as I said, I want to give these their, their moment to shine. It's 40. So it'll be 40 by 60. The canvas one is right. I want to do this one now. <laughs> so Spell Queen, just the two um, that are still sitting in my stash. I have done a couple of other Spell Queen ones um, already. But we have the uh, lovely lady and we have the sunflower. Okay. Right, I will pause, I will tidy Spell Queen away, and then we will go on to Crafties, which I think I've got the most of, which is why I left it to end. Right, okay, Spell Queen. Not Spell Queen, sorry. <laughs> Crafties. Um, now, these first four I haven't unbagged, I haven't unwrapped at all, so I'm not going to open up the boxes. Um, as I said with some of the other ones, um, if I've not unboxed it, um, I won't be doing a proper unboxing today because I'd like to give each individual canvas its little own moment in the spotlight rather than as part of a, a stash video. So I've got four crafties here which are in the boxes which I haven't unbagged if you like. So these are kind of newer ones, um, i.e. I think about a year old. Now you will, there we go, probably recognise this image if you have seen my paint by number stash video, I will link that as well. And um, this is the one that I've got in both paint by number and diamond painting. And I'm wanting to do a comparison between the two this year. So yeah, if you're interested to see how that will turn out, I'm going to be doing it at some point during the year, not entirely sure when. Um, this is kind of one of the reasons why I'm not doing events this year is because I've got all these little projects that I want to do that I was going to do last year, but got, you know, tied up in too many other things. So, yeah, this is going to, going to be done this year, along with the paint by number. Uh, the artist, I think, is not on the box. I think it is Sybil, Sybil Art. 
Is it civil art that crafties do? I think it might be. Hold on, let me check. Ah, I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure. I thought our name was on the name was on something. Um, what I will do is I will put the artist's name across um the uh the screen. Okay, I'll do the same for these other ones um that I haven't unboxed. I'll make sure I put the artist names on the screen. So here we have got this lovely lady here in green. This is the same artist as the flowers. Let me see, is there a bigger picture? No, there's not a bigger picture. So we have this lovely lady here in green. Again, I think you can get her in a paint by number as well. I might have a look for it and pick it up. So if that comparison goes well, I will do this one as well. Um, we have, I've got to have a stag. Um, I've got two or three stag diamond paintings. This one looks amazing. I think this is one's got special diamonds in it. I think a lot of the crafties ones actually have got special diamonds. They're not just your regular drills. They've got, you know, glow in the darks or jellies or rhinestones, twinklers. You know, they've got a whole variety of different um, types of gems in there. So, yep, I have that one, the stag artist's name has gone across the screen this one i don't need to tell you the artist's name because it's on there it's david loblo and it's the jellyfish i think a lot of people have uh, seen this actual painting same with the stag as well actually now i think these are all 40 by 50s these diamond paintings all um all four of them and this i know is full of special gems so that's going to look gorgeous definitely um this one the jellyfish i think was brought out uh is a is like a re-release uh, it's actually got glow in the dark drills now this time so that's the newer release okay so last but not least we have got two more these ones are well open because these are in plastic bags. I've had these a little bit longer. Um, they, before they started sending them in the boxes, crafties used to send them in plastic bags. So these are maybe a couple of years old. So we have this lovely purple lady. Same artist as the... Um, same artist as the, the flowers. And the other lady that are in the boxes, I've got a feeling it's Sybil Art. Rounds. And it's 40 by 40 by the looks of things. Well, it says 40 by 45, but this isn't, this is square. <coughs> Let me get my trusty, um, uh, where did it go? I literally had my tape measure and now it's disappeared. I thought it's got up to the back of my drawer. So it's 40 by 45. It's 40. Uh, 40 by 40. It's a misprint on the canvas. So we have, yes, we have this lovely lady. I think it's got a name. It is called the flowered hat I think printing's very very small and last but not least we have <coughs> I think what was my first crafties that I bought actually this one these are all rounds Yep, these are all rounds, but with specials in them as well. And it is Neon Owl. Again, I'm not entirely sure on the artist on this one. Um, Craft Easies are legally licensed, so... Um, I wonder if it's the same as the Jellyfish. I wonder if it's the same artist that did the Jellyfish. I don't want to say, but I'll put, it, I'll, I'll, I'll put the name across there. But we've got our Owl. Yay! 
oh there are so many of these i want to do now so many of them i want to do i want to do that sunflower definitely want to do that sunflower i want to do my hair i want to do my hair <laughs> i want to do moon gazing hair as well gosh gosh what to do what to do right quick recap on the craft easies then we've got the owl we have got the purple girl purple flower girl we have got uh, the poppies um that i've also got picked by number oh we have got the jellyfish I've got, uh, where's the picture? There it is, the stag. And we have also got a very small picture. We have the green lady. Lovely. Oh gosh. So um, I don't think this is taking too long. Um, I, you know, I don't, I don't want these to turn into, as I said, mammoth long videos. Um, yeah. So this is part one, if you like, of my premium kit or boxed kit stash. So we had paint gem, craft buddy, um, spell cream, and craft ease. Okay. Part two, um, I'll organise that together um, in two or three weeks, perhaps. Uh, we'll see how it goes. It's just, as I said, it's just finding the time to do it. Um, I do have them all. I, 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 they're all at hand, but it's just, it's just sort of digging them out um, can take a little bit of time. So, uh, yeah, what do you think of these ones? How many do we have all together here? If you count the paint gems as one, each paint gem kit is like one canvas. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So that's fourteen canvases. So uh, not quite as bad as I thought it was, <laughs> um, but still, still a nice, a nice little, uh, nice little few to be getting on with. Anyway, um, thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this um, trip into my stash. I think this is going to be now part three because I've done my budget. I've done my paint by numbers and I'm going to start, st I've started on these box kits. Now, as I said, I might go back to the budget ones later on in the year. You know, maybe budget canvases revisited part two. <laughs> um, yeah. So if you have enjoyed it, can you please give this video a big thumbs up? Um, if you would like to subscribe to my channel, um, that would be very, very much appreciated. I would love to have you here. You can um, be notified if you hit that notification bell as well. And you will know when my next videos are coming up. Um, it could be another stash video. Um, um, also um, got some uh, diamond paintings that I'm working on. I've got my Josephine walls that I'm, I'm doing. I've got paint by numbers that I've i'm in the middle of doing as well and plus i've got some random craft kits as well so there's a there's a bit of a, of a variety mostly diamond painting though but um spicing it up a bit here and there with other bits and pieces so thank you very much for giving me some of your time and i'll see you all in the next video okay cheerio guys